I have good news for you guys that are still stuck with Windows XP and don't want to uh, upgrade to either Windows 7 or Windows 8 because X let's face it XP was awesome I love XP um, it was the first OS that I worked with and um, if it was up to me the last one that I would work with <laughs> but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how you can continue to get security updates for Windows XP by following a hack um, posted in digitaltrends.com alright so we're in digitaltrends.com right now I will post a link on the description of the video for this um, website for this web page but once you're at this web page go ahead and click where it says how to hack the Windows XP registry to get security updates again right here um, I will post a link of the actual direct link to the article but I want to point out right here that the security update is good till 2019 so would you look at that till 2019 you guys could still use your Windows XP <laughs> alright let's click on the article alright like I said I will post a link for this uh, for the direct uh, access to this article also so basically if you scroll down on this article it will tell you the directions on how to just scroll down apparently my computer is giving me a hard time running really slow all right here we are so go ahead and um, open up a notepad all right a text document and uh, save it as XP dot reg all right make sure you have file extensions on and uh, make sure the extension on it is dot reg dot reg all right save it like that once you successfully uh, rename the file right click it click edit and then paste this text right here into the document and then save it as a dot reg file a registry file okay once you save it double click it and like it says right here once you do that you're done from here on out windows will up will pull updates that are meant for windows embedded industry to your windows xp just use windows update like you normally would now uh, this only works on the 32-bit edition 32-bit versions of windows xp now there is another article on how to do it on 64-bit uh, ed uh, edition of windows xp but but it is very complicated well to me at least it seems very complicated but i will also post a link on the description of the video for the 64-bit uh, hack also okay and here's the instructions here basically you have to download manually from the windows it's actually down here from microsoft.com you have to manually download the update which is an update called update just update it says first you need to download manually the update from microsoft only problem is it doesn't tell you which update see that's where i'm stuck right here all right um I welcome you guys to go ahead and try to figure this out um, because it says here download ma manually the download manually the update from Microsoft.com but yet it doesn't tell us which one but anyway once you download it um, you create an update.cmd file you do this you do uh, this modification to the source code and then you copy it and to the new update then you delete the uh, the old one. To tell you the truth, I really don't know how this is done. All you uh, programmers out there um, that know how to do all this, I would really appreciate it if you comment on the comment section of the video below and let us know how this works. All right. So the 64 uh, bit hack looks a little bit more complicated, but the 32, if you have 32 bit, then it's just as simply as making a reg file, copying and pasting this text into it and then double click it and that's it all right that's how you hack Windows XP so you can continue to get updates till 2019 thanks for watching guys uh, if you have any comments or any um, any updates on new news about all this go ahead and uh, leave us informed in the comments section thanks for watching guys hopefully this has helped you guys out that are still using Windows XP and want to continue to use it don't forget to, to subscribe to my channel. I'm always posting new videos on new news that's coming out. And um, talk to you guys soon.